you know, you just can't beat some of the great hymns of the church. You know, like, my hope is built on nothing less than Jesus' blood and righteousness. Today, Jesus is telling you, even before you were born, you began to grow in my heart. Do you believe that? 1 Peter chapter 1, verse 3 talks about being born anew to a living hope. That's a baptismal image, and it's all about rebirth or adoption, really, as children of God. It's all about the lavishness and the extravagance of God's grace given in baptism, giving you a hope that is real. You know, I don't know about you, but some of the things that I'm doing these days still represent a sort of a moving away of the last year and a half, moving away from that and into whatever is going to come next. I had some conversations with some colleagues and we're going to resume our every Tuesday morning tech study in about one week. And it's time. It's time to hear the Father's word. Not because we're pastors. Not because of what we do for a living. No. But that's what children of the Heavenly Father do. We assemble to hear a word of life from a source that is unlike any other. We come to hear a word of grace, a word of life from a heavenly parent who began to love us, yes, even before we were born. Think about it. Today, we know that that is what grace to go is all about.